Give me a light. Hi. So it's been a few days. Actually, I feel like it's been a lot of days. Um, I haven't had a chance to take myself out on another date because, I mean, I've gone out to eat a lot by myself to restaurants, but I figure that's like a pretty boring date compared to what I could do. So I'm planning to go ice skating for my next date, I think, on Saturday. But I consider dating myself doing things I love, and I love home goods. So I thought I would stop at... Oh, there it is. I thought I would stop at Home Goods and see if I can find anything that I like. Honestly, just good vibes. And I love shopping alone. Anyone who likes to shop with other people, I feel like just something's wrong with you. I just have much, I can just zone in, get in the zone way better when I'm shopping alone. So let's go shopping for a little bit. And I promise we're gonna do some more interesting dates here in the near future. That was such a fail. <laughs> the camera, I tried to do like a cool transition and the camera strap got stuck on my shift thing. So the only thing I could possibly be looking for right now because I really don't need anything, but I am wanting to replace the pillows on my bed to make them a little bit more cozier and yeah, just cozier. And I think like more white pillows. And then I'm also looking to decorate my bookshelf a little bit more that I just got. So that's kind of what I'm looking for. Really don't need anything, but you know, you come to Home Goods and it just communicates what you need in your life and you just listen. That's how it works. You, these pots are pots. Is that what it's called? I wish I had like a boho style so I could buy that. But honestly, my whole place is so modern and I'm just like a modern girl. But it's like, I'm a modern girl who wants to be boho. And, but it's too late. Everything in my apartment's like mirrored and modern so I can't make the switch. I'm wondering if I can like do both. I like, excuse me. I've been eyeing these. I feel like this is a good way to incorporate plants, but in a modern way with the glass. How much is this? $30. If you like shopping at Home Goods, definitely check out their healthy food section because there are some gems always hitting in here. Today I have found this macadamia nut milk. They actually sell this and use this at my favorite coffee shop. So I might get this. It's only $2.99. They also have some matcha. This is where I get my maca powder and cacao nibs. Have these coffee table books and a trick I learned is to check what the color looks like like that's really pretty without this ugly cover on it but it is still $30 and I just cannot get myself to spend that on a book that's gonna sit on me Sunday. I'm sorry if it's a little loud right here. I probably didn't choose the best place to set up this camera because um, I'm right by a busy street. But I just parked at a coffee shop and this is going to be my last date, I think, for this video. So it's really loud. I should probably... Okay, we're going to move. Okay, hopefully this is a little quieter. You guys are... Well, now these birds! Oh my gosh!
Okay, are y'all gonna be quiet for the video? Thank you. I'm not trying to scare you. This is what happens when you date yourself. You start talking to yourself and you start talking to the birds. So, here I am. <laughs> okay, so, like I said, this is gonna probably be the last date. This is gonna finish off the video. And I've been wanting to take myself like ice skating or to a concert or just something a little more extreme I guess not extreme but like pushing my boundaries a little bit because I've just been taking myself out to eat and I went dancing that one night which was fun but it's kind of turned into this thing where I like feel like I need to go and force myself to go ice skating or do something that you know I'm not really in the mood to do just for the video and I was talking to my friend and I realized you know I'd rather do something that's more natural to me and more genuine and to me that is just going to a coffee shop like sitting outside it's so beautiful out here in Arizona right now so I think that's just what I'm gonna do I'm not gonna I was gonna take myself ice skating and don't get me wrong I love ice skating but I was just trying to force it and I feel like when you're dating yourself you going outside of your comfort zone is very important but it's also really nice to just find ways to date yourself in like a casual way and to me that is going to a coffee shop jumping around getting a brownie and a matcha latte and just hanging out getting work done reading my bible so that is what i'm gonna do today so i'm taking you with me as my final date I'm not gonna lie, this whole journey hasn't been easy or perfect. Um, it's been about two weeks of me doing this, these videos, and um, I think they're going well, but I won't lie, there have been days where I was sad and lonely and spending time alone. Like, I got a breakfast sandwich alone after church one day, and I was not happy. I wasn't happy dating myself. I was lonely. My ac Actually, I, I went to church and my ex-boyfriend was getting baptized that day and um, we were just not talking and he afterwards went out with all my friends to lunch and I obviously couldn't go because I just needed that boundary and I felt really lonely. So I'm not going to sit here and tell you this video has been fun or the past two weeks have been perfect um there have been ups and downs with feeling that loneliness but that's just what it takes to become happy being alone you have to have some lows and some moments of loneliness to appreciate and really learn how to get over those and get through them so just wanted to share my truth a little bit but let's move on to some more happy stuff um this area is really cute and you know i don't have an instagram boyfriend so i figured i would start my date with myself by taking a few pictures of myself on self timer so we're gonna just get that going let's scout out a spot um i really just love like plain walls i feel like this archway is really pretty but the spot i have my eye on is right here with these trees so I'm gonna try to set up a shot right here texted me and told me he has an extra ticket to a festival he's working at so I'm down at Mill Avenue gonna go to a music festival have no idea anyone who's there have no idea any bands or who's playing but I'm just gonna walk around by myself probably eat some food listen to some music maybe dance a little bit and yeah that's 